really good. This, you would never know the difference. Hey my beautiful people, what is up? It's your girl Snatch by Today here and we are back with another video. So clearly we have another series of today's Snatch Kitchen because we are in the kitchen and today I want to show you guys one of my favorite snacks ever to make and it's going to be avocado toast but we're doing a spin because we're doing it with some bacon but the gag is this ain't bacon. So if you want to see how I make some avocado toast and a good and healthy snack that you can have along your healthy journey as well, make sure you stay tuned and keep watching. Okay, so you want four key ingredients to, I always do that, that's eight. You want four key ingredients to your avocado toast. First, we're going to start with some bread. So this is the bread that I like to use and this is nature's own honey wheat. You can use a bagel thin, you can use a thicker sliced cut bread if you would like. This is just the bread that I have in the cabinet, so this is the bread that we're going to use. And this is 70 calories per slice, and it has 13 carbs. So we're going to be using this, and it actually has three grams of protein. So we're gonna be using this as our bread. I already have this um, guacamole or like avocado that's in the container. So we're gonna be using this as our avocado spread. This is going to be our meat source, and this is our bacon. Now, this is from Sweet Earth. And I wanna say this is the field roast brand, if I'm not mistaken, or maybe it's not, but this is the packaging and I got this from Walmart and it's hickory and sage flavored. It's 45 calories per slice. It has four grams of protein and it has zero cholesterol and 60% less sodium than pork bacon. So the service size is one, but we don't ever do the service size around here. So we're gonna go do two. And that is going to be 90 calories for two pieces of this bacon. So we're gonna use this. And then last but not least, you cannot have avocado toast without everything but the bagel seasoning. So we have everything but the bagel seasoning. I actually picked this up from Marshall's. It was $3.99, so we have this. So our oven is preheating on broil, so I'm gonna go ahead and put my bread in the oven so it can toast and get a little brown, and we're gonna go ahead and cook the bacon on the stove top as well, so come on. Okay, so no face, no case, but I want you guys to see um, everything that we're going to be doing. So we have our toast toasted. Our bacon is in the pan. It's still a little bit a little bit hot. So we're going to take our avocado and we're just going to split it in half. And we're going to go ahead and place that on our toast. Now this avocado is basic. It doesn't have any seasonings or anything on it. So you can season it up if you like and then place it on your toast if you would like. I'm just going to go ahead and spread that out all over your toast. So 
same thing for the other. Go ahead and spread out your avocado. Now, if you wanna get fresh avocados, go ahead and do so. I don't like to because every time I get fresh avocado, I never eat them and then they go bad. And then, yeah, we have that. So you have your avocado here. I'm gonna go ahead and put on my everything but the bagel seasoning. Again, you can add as much as you like. I like to add a lot. Give it a nice crunch. Also give it some good flavor. Okay, now I forgot two things. I'm gonna grab some crushed red pepper and some garlic. Cause I love a good spice on my avocado toast. So I'm gonna go ahead and sprinkle some crushed red pepper on top of here. You can step, you can opt out of this step if you do not like spice, but I love spice. And we're gonna sprinkle a little bit of garlic. And boom. So then we're gonna take our bacon. It actually did break a little bit. That's okay. We're just going to pull that apart because I wanna add it as pieces. Split this in half. And it cooks pretty fast. Doesn't take too long. I think you said two minutes on each side or tell you how crispy you like it. I'm gonna add our last piece on here. And it doesn't look the most appetizing, but this is your avocado toast and faux bacon. But I'm super excited to try this and let's see how it's here. Here is our avocado toast with our faux bacon. I'm gonna go ahead and try a piece and see how it tastes. Really good. This, you would never know the difference. It almost tastes like Turkey bacon, it does have that smoky flavor to it, so it's actually really, really good. If you have it at Walmart, again, it is the Sweet Earth brand. You definitely have to try this if you are on a no meat kick. If you are still eating meat, I very much eat meat, but if you wanna try it, see how it tastes, it's actually really, really good. So this is a healthy, very delicious, quick and easy snack. You have your protein, you have your carbs, and you also do have your healthy fats and this will keep you full until your next meal so cheers okay babe so that is all i have for you today i just wanted to come to you guys with a quick and easy recipe that you can use along your health journey as well avocado toast is literally one of my favorites so i had to show you guys some different ways that you can spruce it up make it a little bit different especially if you are no meat on your journey of no meat but I'm going to go ahead and finish off my avocado toast. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for tuning in. I definitely appreciate it. We're on the road to 500 subscribers. We're currently at 227. And baby, I could not be more grateful and thankful. So thank you for everybody for your support, your love, your comments that you're showing. I definitely appreciate it. And it does not go unnoticed. But until next time, like I always say, if I can do it, you can do it too. So get them and just do it. Peace.